One of the reasons why so many people voted in the EU referendum was that, for once, they felt their vote would count, as indeed it did. Millions of adults in this country have spent their whole lives in constituencies where, for the most part, their votes have never counted. This election presents us with an unprecedented opportunity. Tactical voting on a large scale is now being actively promoted. Gina Miller launches Tactical Voting Unit. 20 April. The Labour Party could break with the tribal politics which have contributed so much to its decline, especially in Scotland, by making a commitment to introduce a system of proportional representation in the next parliament, and thereby at a stroke increase its electoral chances in this election. The Guardian could lead the charge. While tactical voting cannot solve all the problems of the electoral system, it could make a significant contribution by upsetting the apple cart, and confounding the pollsters, and pundits already forecasting a landslide for Theresa May. Do we really want to conspire in a continuation of the downward spiral of this country begun in 2010 with the deeply damaging policies of the Tories? set to continue ad infinitum unless we can halt their progress. Tribal party politics are in decline because they fail to deliver what is promised. Let's shake up the system and bring some much needed excitement to this election. Peter Swift Winchester, Hampshire I am disappointed by the response of the Lib Dems and Labour to the suggestion of an electoral alliance election pact greens appeal for progressive alliance rejected 20 april i believe in fairness and for many years voted liberal as they seemed to have policies that fit my view of the world that all came to a crashing end i had been aware of the clear need for a change to our voting system but the 2010 election brought that to a head and when i looked at all of the manifestos the only one that came near to my views was the Green Party's. It is in the interests of the current ruling elite to keep the status quo and fragment opposition. Sadly, the Lib Dems and Labour seem to be abetting this, rather than taking a clear view of the long-term picture. Sarah Mould Norwich Join the debate minus a mail guardian.letters at theguardian.com Read more Guardian letters minus click here to visit goo.com forward slash letters.